Hey, what's up, guys? Sonic Stealth, and I'm about to bring you guys the finale of our Let's Play of Sonic CD for the Xbox One. So, in the last video, we did Wacky Workbench, started a speedway, we raced against Metal Sonic, and we saved Amy. So, here we are at the final stage of this game, Metallic Madness, which, you know, it did come back in Sonic Mania as well. I like that a lot better man than I did here, I know that. Oh man, now we're going to go all the way back, because freaking I don't know how to jump, I guess. There we go! Got it down pat this time. Good. Here we are in the past of metallic madness. But we need to keep going down, right? I believe so. Well, I'd love to go down. I think these springs here would let us. There we go. Yeah. Okay, yeah, now we're going the right way. I had to make sure. I haven't done this in quite a while. Okay, yeah, we're going to stand here and wait just to be safe. Oh, what the deuce, man. Maybe not, because freaking jump still isn't working. Oh my gosh. Wait, there we go. That's it for zone one of metallic madness. I do that. She don't know. Keep it awake. Because the videos do upload at a regular pace. This will be our new recording software. So anyways, here we are at zone two, which is easily the longest level in this game. It does take a little while compared. To, it's way longer compared to most of the stages in this game. Because you know, I was saying you play about a minute, a minute and a half. This one takes about at least about four minutes. You know, you know, you know, if you're going for like, you know, the, you know, the ro the generator. Okay, come on, Sonic. Can you like? This one might take about five minutes, thanks for the look. Well, this one's easy to travel back in time to the past. I come up here and just hop in between those. Is that bro, Sanic? Ah, oh, that was close. I got this pipe on him. 
believe so. I believe not so. Okay, had a brain fart. We need to go this way if I'm not mistaken. Yep! What did I expect? And there we go, and with destroying that robot generator, we have successfully secured the good ending. So, good, we should get a pat on the back for that, because we've just got ourselves the good future, I mean, the good ending, uh, the good future of the stage and the good ending of the game. So, huzzah, good job, us. Oh, you say, I this time I know. This time I know. There are so many times in the past. Before. And he still hit me from all the way back there. See, this is the reason why these guys are annoying. I was ready for you that time, what not, boy? Okay, we only go this way. I'm just looking up. That gummit! So a little walk with these. Of course, these and these things themselves, they come back in Sonic Mania, but they're in Lava Reef Zone instead of Metallic Madness Zone. Here we go, the original Shibi Sonic. He's here. Oh God, I keep shooting my jump too short. Hey, it's okay. Uh, we don't need to get crushed because we crushed. We gotta go all the way back to the beginning. Do this all over again. And trust me, it's four minutes I've spent on this stage. I really don't want to go back and do it. Do this all over again, especially not now that we're so close. It's like, aha, we will force you though if you die in this final little chamber here. Yeah, and you get next. Anyways, there we go! That is it for Zone 2 of Metallic Man. It almost takes five minutes. Just keep it awake. So anyways, on to the final stage of this game. Metallic Man is Zone 3, and it is in the good future. Let me look at this. Look how good this looks. This little mini waterfall right here. Getting a screenshot of that, you know, I can't really see it. Oh, jeez. Okay, that went well. Bro, we about to make it through this whole game without dying? Wow, dude, I can't believe Rex might make this whole thing without dying. Hopefully. 
if we can still screw up and die. There we go. That is open the pathway to the final boss. AKA Final Fever. Eggman's little fan bladed robot as I like to call it. Oh, after this, we'll be able to go on Sonic 3 in the Mega Collection. Which is, you know, I'm guessing everybody's favorite classic Sonic game, you know. It's, if not that, it's definitely Mania. Of course, kind of like GamerGuard7 Ace has said, Sonic CD is basically the black sheep of the classic Sonic games. It's the one that it really did. G oh, what? There's no way I hit that, bro. That was... Anyways, there we go. Sometimes it's quite your right. That first hit, to me, is probably the hardest hit you will ever have to do in this boss. Probably because you only have to hit the man four times. If I can risk it, time it just right. We have the smack and hit now I am early. Got him! Nice. See, it just leaves him more vulnerable after you hit him the first time. And the boss battle just gets... To me, to hit him, it gets easier. I'm hit him coming now. Anyway, there's only one more hit left to get. Dang it! Frick you, Eggman. Oh, jeez. Yeah, you better get a ring back, Sonic. I don't wanna... I told myself we're gonna get this display without dying. Well, I did that about two minutes ago, and there we go! We have defeated the final boss, and we see Amy running in. Oh, you did it, Sonic! Yay! Anyways, there we go. We have successfully defeated Sonic CD with the good ending. So, yes. This is definitely one of my favorite Sonic games. Recording also the game of Guy 7 Aces. This game is getting a lot of hate recently. I think I said something about that back in part 3, which was the last video in the series. Don't know why. I mean, there's nothing wrong with Sonic CD. Sure, it's a little bit. It's a, probably the easiest of all the Sonic games. That's my honest opinion. I think a lot of people probably agree with me. It's definitely the easiest. But I think I really enjoy it every time though. It's just so fun. Yeah, like I said, I knew, I knew Sonic CD wasn't going to take a while anyway. So I guess after this I can record the next part of Sonic 06, since he waited out the turn in exchange for it not saving for Aquatic Base. My favorite movie right there. Sonic Metal Sonic Racing 9 and it's actually the present of Stardust Speedway, not like the futures. Aesthetically, I guess you see the reason why. Why is the Sonic CD type the Sonic 3? Aesthetically, Sonic CD was a 
Technically, it was supposed to come out before Sonic 2, but time constraints pushed it back. And I believe in the overall timeline, Sonic CD happens in between Sonic 1 and 2. So I guess at this time, Sonic and Tails have not met yet. And Sonic goes to Little Planet, so that might be the reason why Tails isn't a part of the main story. But, you know, he's unlockable, which, when you first get the game, all you have to do to unlock him is you just have to beat the game with Sonic one time. And there you go, you can play as Tails. So we got to a little message there at the end. All the flowers that we saved through now. Man, look at that, bro. We're too cool. You're too cool. It has a message like that at the end of Sonic Mania Plus. If you uh, get all the Chaos Emeralds in Encore mode. It has like all five playable characters at Mirage Saloon at one of the ice cream bars. And then, you know, then the Heavy King shows up. And it's just freeze frame. It says you're too cool. But anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this Let's Play. If you guys stuck around for all four parts, thank you for watching it. And I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. So anyways, until next time, I will see you all at Angel Island for Sonic 3 on the Mega Collection. Peace out, guys.